Welcome to Project Bearded. I'm Brian, and this is week nine of my year. Today, I'm going to be reviewing Johnny Ray. But before I jump into that, I would like to ask you guys to show me your support by making sure you give this video a thumbs up when you click the like button below. And if you're not already, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Now, let's jump into today's bearded content. First things first, let's do something we haven't done in a while, and let's take a look at the progress of my beard. Now, as you can see, it is filling in quite nicely. Two months of growth will do that for you. And I know a lot of you guys out there watching are happy to see that I am going with the handlebar. Trust me, I'm happy too. But enough about me, let's jump into this review. First off, Johnny Ray is a company run by a husband and wife out of Michigan, and they are a relatively newcomer to the game. And I wanna be straight with you guys, this wasn't the first time I've tested out any of their products. I did buy one of their sample beard oil packs last year before I started this channel. But what I'm going to be reviewing to, for you guys today is just the products I've been using this week. Alright, the products I'm going to be going over today are their wash bar, their beard oil, and of course their beard balm. And all of these are in their Nirvana scent, which has a profile of Chris Apple, Jade, and Eucalyptus Mint. Alright, now let's talk about each individual product, starting with the Beard Wash. And this product goes for $14.99 on their website. They do sell three packs for about $35. And according to Johnny Ray, a single bar should last you about a month of daily use. And though I haven't used this bar fully, it does seem to be right on track. Of course, if you guys remember from a couple videos ago where I was talking about beard washes, you should recognize this bar because it was one of the items I showed you. And if you can remember from that video, you should notice that it is thinner and smaller than it was a couple of weeks ago. That's because I've been using it every day since then. Not only do I use it daily for my beard, but I do occasionally use it as a facial wash. Sometimes I use it to replace shampoo, and I even use it on my body to replace my soap. Guys, this is a very good wash bar, very gentle, cleans very well, and I highly recommend it. Now let's talk about their beard oil. Yes, this guy right here, it does sell for $22.99 on the website. They of course do sell sample sizes as well as a sample kit where you can check out all of their different scents. That sells for about 60 bucks. However, as of the recording of this video, there is a sale for about $50, which is a pretty good price in my opinion to check out all of their scents. And that's what I originally did last year. Now, as far as my opinion on the beard oil, I'm gonna keep it very simple and say just this. As of right now, if I were to recommend just one beard oil to someone, it would be this guy right here. I don't know what better praise I can give a beard oil than that. So let's move on to the beard balm. Johnny Ray's beard balm does come in a small tin like this to give you two ounces worth of styling balm. It sells for $22.99 and it has a medium hold. As of right now, all I'm using it for is to uh, work this handlebar mustache. Guys, the mustache is still kind of small. The real test will come in when it is much longer, but as of right now, it is definitely doing its job. Now, let's see what the consistency is for the Nirvana scent across all three products. All right, so let's start right from the beginning with the beard wash. All right. Next, we'll do the beard oil. Got it. And finally, the beard balm. All right, so for consistency, I give this a thumbs up. You can definitely tell it is all part of the same scent profile. I would say that the wash is probably the strongest out of all three, but you can pick up definitely the, uh, the soapy scents that come with it being a wash. The 
oil is probably the purest in that I mean that it is pure fragrance that you're smelling. And with the balm, you can definitely pick up on the butters and waxes used to make a balm a balm, but the uh, Nirvana scent does come through quite well. So good job there for consistency and keeping everything together. And that wraps up today's review. Now, if you're still watching, that must mean you've enjoyed today's bearded content. So if you didn't in the beginning, make sure you've clicked that like button below, giving this video a thumbs up. Be sure you're subscribed to the channel and turn on those notifications. That way you guys won't miss any of my videos. Don't forget to leave a comment, share this video with your friends, and while you're at it, head over to Instagram and follow me there at Project Bearded. A link will be in the description. Once again, I'm Brian, this is Project Bearded, and I will see you guys in the next video.